More run, boys. There it is. Rare relic. Ooh, it's tantalizing. It's tantalizing. Mmm. Take care, T-Peaks. We're gonna get one more good run here, and then we're gonna do some, uh... Well, I do have to do some stuff, but I do wanna... I wanna get a plat on Rocket League as well. I'm excited to get plat on Rocket League. More so than I'm excited to get 2,000 ELO in chess. Isn't that funny? Well... Well, um... Okay. So this one's a win. This is a ban. It's a win. Oh, got a win in the... <laughs> yeah, you can still lose very much, so... I don't know where I want to go. This way is where I want to go. Corruption? Alright guys, let's make a prediction. On what floor we're gonna find corruption? Before floor 30 or after floor 30? Make a prediction. I'm gonna use the bathroom. Oh, there should be a, there should be a prediction um, of no corruption at all. I guess. That would suck. Alright, boys. And the bright side. Havoc? Who wants Havoc with that bridge? Oh my god. Double rare relic? Guys, I didn't make the seed. I didn't make the seed. Don't blame me. The bus is great. All right, there's a bludgeon. I mean, this is RNG, guys. Corruption may or may not show up. It's up to the RNGs to, to, to decide here. Havoc is an MVP. Sentinel. And Sentinel. Sentinel makes sense in the world of Havoc, no? Guys. Havoc take the wheel. Havoc take the wheel. How I broke the game and got away with it. Who wants to bottle this flame? I mean, Hemokinesis' first turn is pretty good. Oh my god, say hello to Albie boys. Say hi to Albie. Ah. Skins, you gotta take her to the vet this week. Take her to the vet this week. All right. Who wants to bottle hemokinesis? Or who wants to say... Hey, Rampage is cool for Guardian, but hemokinesis is good for, like, chunking these things. Like, the Guardian, so the Guardian doesn't kill us, you know? Well, that's my envisionment. Where's my havoc? 
Where's my havoc? What? I know y'all are jealous I can play Clash. I know you're jealous. Yeah, I can play Clash. What about it? I want more exhaust. Can I get some more exhaust, please? Oh, this is all the exhaust I could ever ask for. Thank you so much. <gasps> oh my god. It finally happens. It's here. It's really here. It's really here. Funeral Bane. Jokes on you guys. That's prophetic. Jokes on you guys. That is prophetic. Y'all don't realize the corruption spawning the next 10 floors. Oh, I saw for a moment I felt it. Imagine by membership card and then nothing else. There's no anchor, there's no fairy, there's no shrug, it's just a membership card. Lake game scaling. I trust in my dead branch. Please don't fail me. Havoc. Reaper. Who wants to see a magic trick? Rampage is going to scale and win the game. Entrench. Havoc. Excuse me, sir. I believe we have a problem here. Explain to me why I did that. Why did I do that? <gasps> I got rid of my only scaler. Oh, that's not a problem. That's not a problem. Oh, they stop me right now. That's not a problem. That isn't a problem. It isn't a problem. It isn't a problem. It isn't a problem. Barricade and trench. <gasps> Booyakasha! The prophecy! The prophecy! It's been fulfilled! Here it is. Here it is. Corruption. All right, ready to go home. All right, show's over. Gotta walk my dog in a bit. Oh my God.
Is this the Sneko Dead Branch Dream with Havoc Zero Cost? Uh oh. I want Sneko, but I'm taking this. Sneko is just damn good, guys. Especially because if you get Sneko Corruption, I mean, let's say let's say we're gonna will corruption into existence. Well, then, in that case. In that glorious case, I just want to go all in on corruption and never look back. That's all I want to do right now. Is say corruption, take the wheel. Find corruption, take the wheel. Is that so? Is that so wrong? Another Havoc? Yes! We live in a world where we're taking Havocs over Uppercut. And it's a damn good world to be in. Alright, close to Corruption. It's short of Corruption. It's yellow. It's yellow, right? And Corruption is also yellow. You know what else is here? Oh my god, it's a raid from Mc Barity McGee. Thank you so much. Super generous. Welcome, guys. We got Dead Branch and Tungsten Raja for two relics. So we're having a lot of fun. And we're just looking for... We're just goading corruption to existence. That's all we're doing right now. Just messing around with some really stupid... Uh, RNG is what's going on. Thank you so much. Hope you had a great stream. You know, this is going to help us find corruption. Believe it or not. This does say Adoran and power. And corruption is a power, so... I'm looking forward to that. What do you mean it doesn't count? Of course it counts. Yeah, it doesn't count. You're right. It doesn't count. Oh, you're right. It doesn't count. You're right. Um, do I need evolve? Perhaps. Are we a little bit mad here? Like going to the sparkle? Yes. <gasps> oh my God! I was scared about the elite. I really was. A part of me was scared, but I should have trusted corruption. I really should have trusted it. And it doesn't fail. Oh boy, look at this. The hemokinesis gives us the strength, which makes the heavy blade even better. Magical. Enchilada burrito is what is what's happening right now. Oh, say it ain't so. Dark Embrace and Corruption. I want cards and some more cards and some more cards on top of that. Yes. This is the good old fun. This is how you fall in love with Slay the Spire. You're, you're 10, 20 hours in. Actually, let's scratch that. You're 30 hours in. You got a little bit of the bug. You're like, okay, one more run, one more run. And all of a sudden, you get Corruption Dead Branch. And you have no idea what the hell's going on. And that's what hooks you. I know. Takes a lot of skill. Takes a lot of skill. <laughs> yes, sir. Pocket watch. Is this the rare relic show? I think it is. Reaper's a good card, huh? 
This just in, Reaper is a good card. This guy, this guy's intense. This guy's intense. Oh my god! Why, Reaper, you can't be this good. Listen, m make it fair for the rest of the g Okay, whatever. Well, GG. Guys, we have a prediction right now. All we care about is corruption. Corruption on floor 30, before or after floor 30. I said that completely wrong. Before floor 30 or after floor 30. And it seems like right now, most people think it's gonna happen before floor 30. And we're on floor 25. So there's gonna be a lot of points lost potentially. Now dual will is great because dual will gives me more Reaper, it gives me more Incaridian. All right, corruption is gonna happen here. Here we go. Here's what's gonna happen, right here. We're gonna get it from this fight. We have Sharon's ashes. This guy's dead. Sick. Pocket watch. Can't forget the pocket watch. Havoc. Havoc into Havoc. I mean, what a dream this is. Don't ever give up, he says. Don't ever give up, he says. We have five floors left. All right, Isaac, I hear you, buddy. I hear you. I hear you, bubble. Already. Reaper back. Here it is. Not that I need it, but it's kind of cool to do it, huh? Alrighty. Corruption here, guys. Who is faithful? Because this is a rare... This is an elite. We get rare chance cards. Rare chance of cards. Cards are rare chance cards. Rare cards. Ah, it's rare, but not what we want to see. So a Havoc or a True Grit. A Havoc or a True Grit. I like Snickle Oil. But do I like it more than uh, Gambler's Brew? I think I do. Alright guys, we have one more floor. Unless we get extremely lucky, it's looking like Bad News Bears. For the, for the believers. Oh, he loved to see Clash. He loved to see it. Hey, this is too fast for you, buddy. There's a whole speed run section waiting for you. And it's scary business. Can I see some good stuff, please? Oh! Brutality! That was really anticlimactic. I don't need Entrench. It's ridiculous. Basically, what you're witnessing is... The lack of... The lack of need to think. And only hope. Alright guys, this is the last chance to get... Corruption. Last chance.
So listen, I know we just got a raid, but my dog really has to use the bathroom. So let's walk the dog. Oh no. Flamer is decent. I want more true grits though. Alright guys, I'll be right back five minutes. I'll try to be quick. Gotta walk my doggy. Yeah, no there's no there's like no rare percent chance. Wait, don't we have like a point point something percent chance to get rare? Somebody knows the math. I think it's like point something. Or maybe not. Alright, be right back. Alright, we're discussing the rare card chance. Card generate from left to right. What's up, I'm doing good reloading. Alright. So, uh, where do we leave off? Corruption. Damn it. Alright, so in the, in the midst of not having corruption, we're gonna need to get some stuff that can help us win. So, an impervious, a feel no pain. I mean, a feel no pain seems like a no brainer. I don't know about you guys. This is an exhaust deck. Impervious is also very good. There's also toolbox. So I pose you guys a question. Toolbox, feel no pain, or feel no pain impervious? It's gotta be toolbox, feel no pain. Also, I got a banana. Who's the Who's the boss? Upgrade that. All right, power. Who wants to do a power pot? Should I? Sure. Okay, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I should have played the. So, what's gonna happen is that. Oh, you're splitting the champ early? Yeah, that's a problem. That's a problem. If we're playing a game of chess, that's a, that's a problem right now. Sorry, Elo. I could do uh, Panache, but actually, I'm going to show you guys something. This is concept in chess that. Imagine something bad happening. So imagine what your opponent can do, right? And do it anyways. So what's the worst case scenario that, that can happen here? Worst case scenario is we split him too early. So we let that happen and do it anyways. And this is what's going to happen. We're going to have 71 HP. We're going to have... Actually, before I say anything. Before I say anything. Let me get some security. Thank you. 
Because Panache is the ultimate, uh... We're not weakened here. Where's Barricade? Where's Barricade? Where's Barricade? Come on. So, so the concept in chess goes like this. Imagine a world where you do this, la la la, and do it. Okay, so it's a corruption. Oh my God, it's floor 33. Can we get, can we give them, can we give them the, uh, the points? Cause guys, that's three floors off. All right, GG. All right, GG. Now we have a question. Um, what do we do here? More energy? Energy is very nice. Curse key seems great. Curse key seems great. I like it. Actually, we have corruption. I mean, we have to get to the corruption though. I'm down with the bell as well. I'm totally good with the bell as well. I would like more energy for Debra and Shenanigans to play more attacks. Yeah, the relics have been insane. We're only, we're only gonna see one chest. Minuscule. I mean, if we're lucky, we can see more chests, but I'm not worried about that. <laughs> I would. I would. Oh, nice. Nice one, dude. Nice one. Nice one. Big nothing record from the getting vaccine soon didn't hurt, but not the effects. Well, Ela, you say that. Ela, you say that. We were also trying to hide under the covers today and just relax. You didn't sleep well last night? Okay. Headbutt versus Sentinel. It's the second dose? Is the, the second dose that does it? Guys, do not worry, I'm a professional. I've traveled many spires. I know how to click cards. You just click them, and then you win. So, do you guys think one corruption is enough to beat the game? I say yes. One corruption, one difference. Battle Trance is kind of baiting me. Because I feel like our card draw is pretty sufficient. But at the same time, Battle Trance helps us get corruption. We also already have one Battle Trance. A 30 card deck. So, has anybody done the math? At what point, with what number of cards in your deck, can you take a second Battle Trance and feel okay about it? I mean, there's obviously on the average turn... There might be getting unlucky, you might get two battle trances, but whatever, we gotta think about the average turn. The average turn, I would say a second battle trance is totally fine here. In a 30 card deck. You know, it's, it's totally fine here. Absolutely fine. We're gonna love that card draw. We're gonna need that card draw. 
Oh, this is my best card. Might as well upgrade it. When you get Dark Embrace early, though, then you feel like a dunce. Like, did I take Battle Trance or Dark Embrace? Yeah, that happens. But look at that Panacea, how nice it is. Oh, are you trying to debuff me? Oh, that's a pity. Did I mention we have Card Draw Pocket Watch? We have Card Draw a multitude of ways if we wanted it. Luckily, we don't need it. It's a truly ridiculous uh, concept, and this is. It is good old-fashioned fun, guys. But you, you guys just came around the raid, and this is the guys, you, you raided me on this. But the two runs before this, I got to the heart both times, and we were super serious. We're, we're making some valid choices. And then you guys come in and you guys see this. I mean, it's a little unfair. It's a little unfair. The title is super serious, but then this is not super serious, so it's okay. Yeah, you see. Got to the heart both times in that time. See, that's... If it was... Okay, I didn't say extremely serious. That, that's like a whole new degree. And when we take five hours, that's when we streak territory. I've taken that amount of time in a run before. But only on a streak. Because then otherwise, you just feel like a... You get exhausted. And I could do that, but I gotta set myself up for it. You know, I have to really... Uh, I gotta be in the right mind space. Spend four hours on a run. It's exhausting. Yes, the win rate goes up. That's for sure. Dominant Nut, thanks for Twitch Prime, man. Appreciate it. It's very exhausting. See... You're subject to stamina issues when you're doing when you go past two hours. Who knows what mistakes you're gonna make? I mean you probably make less mistakes, but you might just burn out at the end and be like, ah, oh, let's get it over with. It takes a lot of patience. Some runs are a lot easier than others. To be fair, if I took extra time in the last two runs. Well. What happened? Yeah, yeah, she's very hot in my room. <laughs> How about this, guys? I like that body slam. Can I do it again? All right, guys, make a prediction. Bottle, bottle Tornado, who's here? Bottle Tornado. Who's calling it? Who's calling it? Wait, what? I didn't mean to do that. Damn it. All right, guys, there's a, there's a, there's a <laughs> Here's an interesting prediction. Here's an interesting prediction. How many cards am I going to play with Corruption when I kill this giant head? Uh, that's actually a really tough prediction to make because I can kind of control that. Never mind. Scratch it. Scratch it. Bottle tornado. Predict that. Come on. That's, that's a perfect prediction. That's a perfect prediction. Okay. 
Calipers, anybody? If we had calipers, we currently have some block. Oh no, the sapphire key. Oh no, no, no. You just willed it into existence. Not like this. Not like this. Guys, I only take that long in a run when I feel like I have to prove something. Because it's not that fun to take 20 hours in a run. It's just not that fun. I mean, it can be fun. It's rewarding when you... Like, but sometimes it's just like... You spend seven hours and you're like, Damn, I'm exhausted. It's fun. No, it is fun. A challenging... I like challenges. Don't get me wrong, alright? That's my MO. But I give a lot of props to Life Coach. For his sheer stamina. He's a mad lad. Of course, dying in Act 2 is not fun either. This is true. Especially if you have a really good strong start. It's a, it's a fine balance. Like, let's say you have a really strong start. And if you have perfect play, or not even perfect play, just good play, you're going to make it there. Some tough decisions, and you're going to make it there. It's very rewarding to get past Act 2. Um, so it goes both ways, of course. See, I think Merle's in the territory where he has something to prove. I'm not saying this. I'm not slighting anybody, by the way. Listen. This is a single-player game. All right? And in a way, you're like, testing yourself against the game. So it's not a slight when I say this. Barricade. All right, so if I can, please don't be bothered, Tornado. All right, well, no harm, no foul. I like the entrench. Okay, 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 okay. Listen. Oh, wait. Wait. Um, you know, I haven't used a potion in a while. Oh, that didn't help. That didn't help. Guys, remind me to upgrade fuel, uh, upgrade dual wield after this. Remind me to upgrade dual wield, please. In my 35 card deck. Yeah, dual wield is all I need to upgrade, and GG is over. That's not even necessary, but it's nice. Well, of course, guys. Dead Branch, for, like, when I saw this, I was like, oh, I get to relax. More so than ever, I suppose. I want Bottle Tornado, that'd be very nice. 
Oh, removal. Oh, med kit. Okay. <laughs> oh, my lord. Oh, my lord. Could take me in the bone, but it's not necessary. It's not necessary. You got, you know, you got to blame. Um, it's, it's injury, which is a little bit better than writhe. Um, but I mean, I could get rid of the injury. I'm not. I don't think me the bones gonna get that much value. I don't think it's gonna get that much value. And uh, I kind of like the blood potion, but I could take a T set and set off this run right. It helps in this donor deck fight, and it helps in Act Four Elite. Nah, we'll save our money here. It's not even because why not? Because oh, um, can I guarantee barricade? I can. That's always fun. That's always fun. Mumford hands. Uh, I'll take Mumford hand from this. I would like a Mumford hand. That sounds great right now. This is awkward. Oh my god, you want funeral pain? Say no more! Alright guys, when am I gonna get energy? You ready? Wait! No, Havoc, wait, Havoc, wait. Ah, Havoc. That's my bad, that's my bad, that's my bad. Tornado. Okay, 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 I'll take it, I'll take it. Man, there is nothing better than what just happened right here. I love purity, by the way. Purity is fantastic. A lot of damage. Ah, Quebeco. Order. Only thing I gotta worry about is, uh, I want to save my gold. Is that crazy? Wait, we can't even afford bottle if we wanted to, right? Ah, but you want to play me in chess? I'd be down to pivot to chess after this. I can't even afford. I can't even afford bottle, right? Bottle is like 167, 170. I want to upgrade to a will though. 
Oh, membership card. Oh, we can get bottle. We have membership card. Thank you. Elo. Thank you. We can afford bottle. Thank you. Look at this. I'm gonna get dual wield. You ready, guys? Look at this. Dual wield. Oh my god. This is disgusting. Look away. Look away. Close your eyes, please. This is not for the faint of heart. This is not for the faint of heart. I feel bad. Nah, I wanted... I wanted that order particularly. Wait a minute, 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 wait a minute. That's a lot of damage. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Stop, stop, slow down. No, it can't be true. Alright, give me body slam right here. Body slam right here. Oh, this is so degenerate, guys. It's so degenerate. I know, guys. I can't control it. It's not my fault the game gave me this. I am playing solitaire. Right, I want to save Sundial. If, in the very least, let me save Sundial. Let's just rush. Let's just rush to the heart so I can find the sh get a bottle in the shop to really bring this home. Let's just rush to the heart. Let's not even mess around. I want exact lethal only. Exact lethal only. Wait, this is actually a counter to me. One second. This is actually a counter to me. I'm scared because I need to get a card I can play. Damn it. Give me a sec. It's time for pain. Oh uh, boy. Alright. We're fine. We're in the clear now, boys. Everybody go home. It's all good now. All right, we're fine now. We're back to regular schedule programming. It solved. It got scary for a second. And we're fine. Let's get Sundown back. I can get Sundown next for Elite. If I do pocket watch a couple times, I can get Sundial. Let's get Sundial.
Rupture is insane. Alright, Sundayo. And now we kill him. But first we find a random Reaper. But first we find a random Reaper. Are we gonna get a Reaper in time? Guess not. A region pot. We're gonna be full life anyways. Alrighty. We get a Ford bottle. Here we go. I kind of like Impervious more than Barricade. Shocker. Oh my god, is that another Impervious? This is Pellets! Because, you know, getting vulnerable from the heart kind of sucks. This is tough, actually. Because Pellets' speed pot is disgusting. Almost no-brainer status. Oh, GG. And also Battle Trench, exactly. Oh my god, Entrench. That's nice. That's very nice. I'm very happy. Let's use our region pot here. What do you guys think? But like after this. Because that was a pretty bad turn. Wait, we actually might die here. This is hilarious. Because I need to change my direction. God damn it, why does Act 4 Lee have to do this to me? Please don't do this to me. Oh, divine comedy. Ah. Uh. I need dark so when you don't get dark embrace early, I guess you see some of the problems. When dark embrace early it doesn't exist. So bottle tornado really is the savior at the end of the day. Alright, so I'm gonna stall this fight and get Reaper. I'm gonna stall this fight and get Reaper here. Let's not do too many exhausts. So this is a down this is actually troublesome because I'm actually killing them with Sharon's Ashes. But I really want to get Reaper. But I don't make enough strength. So I gotta make an effort to do a lot less. I got I could do a world reaper. Alright, this is possible. This is possible.
I still enough life to heal with. So that's fine. I can do a couple more. Let's pause. There's a Reaper. Um. Okay. So we're looking at not good enough numbers. But I've been down this road before. This guy might die before I get a sufficient a sufficient Reaper. So I may just need to like do it and just not look back. Although this is also looking like the heart might run into some issues. Although the heart has speed pot. All right, give me a second. Yeah, I can bring this here before a Reaper, but this is not good enough. Is that... Am I asking for too much? If I did Hema, I had Rupture. Uh, that's probably better. It's sufficient. I could probably milk it a little bit more. One second. I can milk like uh, the sundial in the very least. I'm gonna trust me. Getting through Sundial is going to be a long journey. A long journey for Sundial, but it's going to be worth it. It's going to be worth it, he said. Fuck. That was close. I'm saying Sundar's worth it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, I think Sundial's worth it. Pocket Watch is a consideration, though. I can't really... I can't really dilly-dally here. Because Art of War is also a consideration as well. Art of War... I need to get a Powers for the, the Vulnerable as well. Um, and my next card draws are pretty important. So, but Headbutt is a thing. Is Art of War really worth it when I have this much damage in hand? Well, Akabeko is making me false confidence. Headbutt in the very least gives me Havoc, which is pretty decent so then I lose one energy in favor of the havoc next turn also pellets exists
I need to play an attack. Got lucky. Got lucky. GG. Alrighty. Did we dig for dual wield first? Do we dig for dual wield first? All in favor of digging for dual wield. Say aye. Do a wield. I want to maximize my card roll because I really want this dual wield. Oh, yeah, brother. Okay. Now, here's the bigger problem. One second. Uh, how much can I get away with? Enough. I don't want to draw into corruption. So I pass. Corruption? And barricade? Hello? I could have pocket watched. I also don't want to draw back into this combust. I don't want to draw back into it. <laughs> oh my god, it's so stupid. It's so stupid. You guys were mad, but don't be mad. Get glad. It's here. It was scary. And don't get me wrong. I got a little scared at the end. Imagine getting scared in the spider. God, that's not a good feeling. I gotta get back to full life. This is dangerous. It's dangerous out here. Wait, why is this run longer than the other ones? What? GG. Act 4 Elite gave me a real scare. Whoa. Act 4 Elite was scary. 
I'll tell you what, guys. Three hearts in a row, but I also should have taken my time in the first two runs. That's for Elite, man. The ultimate gatekeeper. The heart was a little bit scary because we had Corruption Barrack at the bottom of the deck, but we, we managed that just fine. I, in fact, don't forget, I had to exhaust a burn with medkit to get an uppercut or any attack so I wouldn't die. So that happened.